So I just made it down to our uh, next location, which is uh, overlooking the uh, port of uh, Felixstowe. So uh, absolutely massive those ships are in dock now. So uh, hopefully the sun is uh, on its way down. So hopefully should get some uh, good images. So I just got the camera set up here using some of the uh, obviously uh, wooden posts that are um, obviously in the foreground here, leading obviously through the image and then obviously up to the uh, container ships in the background, which is uh, absolutely fantastic. I mean, seeing the size of these uh, ships is uh, absolutely unbelievable. Settings for the camera is uh, F16, ISO 100, aperture priority mode is normal, and taking it forward from there. So the next composition is uh, literally just swapping the lenses over. So I've got my uh, wider angle lens on here, about uh, between 10 and um, 16 mil. And um, what I'm actually able to do is get the setting sun now that's uh, just, just dropped down below the clouds and creating this lovely sort of red glow within the sky on uh, the left-hand uh, rule of thirds line. And then on the right-hand rule of thirds, I've actually got one of the, uh, the ships in as, as well. So hopefully, obviously, keeping that balance. Again, got the lovely foreground of obviously the wooden posts as well. So hopefully working out really quite well. So I've got the uh, two-second timer on. Let's take the image. So I've just come a bit further around the beach now and uh, got my next composition. Slightly bit further back up the beach, but now with obviously one of the container ships obviously leaving the uh, Port of Felixstowe. And uh, obviously got that in the middle of the image, got the selling sun in the left-hand third and obviously the, the tanker again, or the cargo ship uh, in, in the dock on the uh, right-hand side of the third as well. So working out really quite well. I've got the, um, uh, gone for F22 on this one as well to get, obviously get a little bit of a burst of the sun um, obviously lo longer exposure smooth out a little bit of the water there's not much of a surf here as well so um, not too much bad but obviously again sort of smoothing out that image working out really quite well. So I just made it down to this jetty for the uh, probably my final image of the day as the sun is just obviously disappearing by a bank of cloud on the horizon but uh, got the tripod set up here um, I've done an image at uh, f16 ISO 100 and also a image at f29 uh, ISO 100 as well the f29 image gave me about um, 0.4 of a second uh, exposure time so obviously again smoothed out a little bit of that water as well so I'll post both images see how they turn out and go from there So that's uh, finished off the uh, photography road trip for today with uh, my uh, camera club, Brady Camera Club. So it's been a really good day. Um, 
really uh, some interesting locations that we've been to, I think. Um, some uh, amazing Im images that some of the other guys have got as well, which is uh, really good. And like I said earlier, it's just uh, really good um, to be out with uh, like-minded people and obviously enjoying the uh, photography as well and sharing in tips, hints, and just generally having a laugh as well. So uh, thanks a lot for, uh, for those who have watched. Um, if you've enjoyed today, uh, please subscribe to the uh, video. Uh, to my channel and uh, also uh, please share it as well because uh, obviously uh, more shares obviously people get to see it and uh, please leave a comment as well because I do respond to every comment as well but thanks a lot and take care